Hello and welcome back to the Outer Worlds. We are just about to head into a very uh, shady alleyway. And maybe we wanna grab a drink before that. Actually, this could be a good time to um, get some bonuses. I can just uh, trigger the Adreno time. Adreno. Just so we have some bonus before hey, we fight. What are you doing here? Berta already pissed by those crates to market. I know you murdered Isaac. Listen, that purple tooth twerp had it coming. Not that anyone has proof. I don't need proof, you just and not admit that it. it's any of your business. Uh, uh well you guys can just die. <laughs> just make sure that the companions don't stay there. Making tracks. Just take them out one by one. Oh no. Um, to shreds, you say? Wow. I guess he's dead. Um, no loot in that one. This is just, uh, old-fashioned justice. On my way. Yeah, we killed him. What are you gonna do about it? Oh, sh Actually, I ran out of, uh, uh, armory thing, yeah. Uh, what should we put in? I want to put in like health en enhancer, movement speed. No, no, I want health en enhancer over there. If that's possible at all. Do we have health enhancer? Because that's that's one thing that I actually value. Not by a lot, but. I guess not. I guess we ran out of health enhancer. Well, I guess we're gonna go with uh, movement speed. Not like it's really worth selling these things. <clears throat> so, Codex. Quests. Tell Sanyar about Isaac's murder. Uh, yeah. Hopefully no one's gonna... You should know you're you mad about King sneaking with these guys from across the company. What can I do for you? Isaac Rose is dead. I found the people who killed him. But that's terrible. What happened? They committed suicide. I've taken care of it. The killers are dead. But that means we won't be able to log their testimonies. Who cares? If there's one thing I've been hoping to re-establish in Stellar Bay, it's proper documentation for legal matters. Well, they attacked me. I had to defend myself. It was kind of silly that I showed up in the alleyway and like... Maybe I could have gotten their statements if they hadn't been ready to kill me. Always a shame when tempers get the better of good sense. Still, your intervention in the matter is much appreciated. Please consider this payment for your services. You're not even gonna double check my story? I just I just got paid for killing some people in the alleyway. Well thanks for that. Uh quest type <clears throat> monarch. Search for clues about a weapon. No. Oh. Speak with the information broker at Devil Speak. Search the house. Oh yeah, we're gonna well that's outside. Look for Tucker, Needham, in Amber Heights, again outside. Meet with Katrin, again outside. Everything is outside now. Very much outside. And what else? Both with his name, that's, that's again outside. So, I guess we're going. Uh, one thing we can consider doing, uh, that I'm not... Wait, what? Can I save? Yeah, I can save. What I, what I was not doing 
uh, is uh, go to the workshop thingy and maybe like try to spruce up our, our gear a little bit. I'm, I'm not really in the habit of tinkering. I guess this is a bad habit in this game. I'm kind of used to just, uh, well, not being able to do that. Oh crap, actually we would need to... 54 3.6 on top of already we already got that's it it goes to 60 which is actually quite impressive so I push it to level 22 and Parvati has a 60 60 armor that looks pretty good how about Nyoka? Not as lucky. And actually I have better gear on the ship. Uh, used by Ali. But do we go back to the ship? Actually it might be a good idea anyway. Because it would allow me uh, to just rest and uh, not uh, suffer any uh, penalties <clears throat> for, uh, for the journey ahead of me. Can't stall out, the unreliable takes flight, come on! The unreliable is pretty good. We, we might need to rename it, but like, there's no need to rename it. It's, it's just a good chip. Okay. Crew report, Bioka is drunk. Surprise. I don't know. So, we're going for rest, then uh, a little bit of drink. That's good enough. And how are we doing with the carry weight? Um, not great. Uh, I could certainly justify sending some stuff. Uh, can I just uh, gain access to the armor of my companions here? Elex, Sam, Vicar Max, Nyoka. So we can take Ellie, replace her armor for something not as good, for now. And uh, Nioka is going to wear that. And I'm going to spruce up at least the armor because that seems like something that we can uh, keep using for a longer time. I can also maybe... Wait. Well, that's lower level, right? No, no, no. That, that's the one. That's the one we want. Uh, not, not, not mod. Let's just, let's just tinker it real quickly. It's, it's a little costly, but it's kind of worth it. 60, 60. And we can also modify it. But with what? More armor. So this is just better armor again. Uh, the silver tank is what I, I like to use. Uh, definitely not for them. Interactable highlight range plus 5 meter. Wow. So we're gonna put in a toughened. That should be good enough. Oh, we, we can put in a, an armor kit, a skill kit. And a utility kit. Physical armor 5. This is the gadget. Skill kit. Tech skills. Range weapon skills. I guess I can give it give this to them. I don't think it matters too much. Anyway, uh, they are wearing it right now. I, I really don't have the best stuff. <laughs> oh man, but I don't need it. I'm more sensible. I don't need to like face tank bullets. So I guess we are leaving. This is good enough. Hunting rifle ultra. We can modify this, and if you can put a silencer on it, that would make it actually useful. So I'm just gonna install a mod if we can. That makes it silenced. 
I can also add magazine, a plasma type magazine. That would not help against robots. Explode into plasma when fired. It's kind of hard to say, but it's gonna increase the damage. Look at how it. <laughs> Look at this gun. I can tinker on it to increase the the damage. Of course, this is a sniper. This is not about the DPS. This is about the single shot damage. Oh, I, I can tinker it only three times. That's the that's the cap. <clears throat> yeah, one ninety six with two hundred forty five single shot damage. I, I can't tinker it anymore. Why can I? I can. But maybe I shouldn't. It's just getting more and more expensive. We don't we don't need it to be more uh, powerful. Uh, I'm gonna take uh, Parvati and Nyoka, and that's that's good enough. I'm not super into Nyoka right now. I mean, she's fine, but yeah. Seems like this is her area. At least uh, she does have one mission. After that, she might get benched. Hi, hey, Grim. So, we are heading out of town. But before we do that, uh, going for a trade, something else might be okay. So we sell. Mm, not that. Even these are like questionable. I can keep one or two, but we don't really need it. Eh. Let's see the armors. So tech skills, stealth skills. Oh, uh, that's actually counts as lockpicking. So I should probably keep this. Stealth skills again. Uh for actually less. No, this is better. Because it allows me to put in a skill kit. Again. I'm not exactly sure what skill kits we got. We can put in tech skills. Leadership skills. Maybe I should keep an eye out for uh, these armor mods. As I maybe get better at the game. So be these are basically both uh, kind of easy to carry. But this might allow me to like double up on the stealth skills maybe. This is kind of weak. Actually, fuck. We need that back. Isn't that my main armor? No, I guess the anti-riot gear is... Very questionable attire. Very questionable. Well, okay then. <clears throat> I guess this is what we're going with. Uh, actually, may maybe before Something that. Up. Maybe I want to sell the junk. Whatever I, junk I got. Not a lot, but uh, we sell that. And we can head out of town over here as well. This is something that we just stumbled upon, and it could be interesting. What? Oh yeah, here. The dissident hunter, when indentured servants are freed, Can anarchy soon follows. Oh, you wanna talk? Hey, got a favor to ask you. Figure while we're out here in the wilderness anyhow, we might stop in on an old friend of mine. Preferably before we get to Hiram's. It's on the way, don't worry. 
You don't seem the type to run off and get yourself killed. And I could use the help. Thanks. I'll be up front with you. I hate asking for help. I hate it. Every time I give someone the opportunity to disappoint me, they seem to make it their most immediate goal. But this, what I'm thinking, it's dangerous. Well, I would hate to disappoint you by dying. I'm honored you're asking. I'm thrilled that to accept. What can I do? Well, I'm not. maybe not as thrilled. What kind of danger are we talking about here? Nothing I can't... We can't handle. This is bullshit. Come on, give me some intel. Let's hear it. I used to run with a band of hunters. Friends. Six of us. We were on Monarch when the corporations pulled out. And we helped a lot of people pick up the pieces. I haven't seen two of them in years. And the rest I know to be dead. I'd like to gather their effects and bury them all in the same places. With the family we once were. Mm, what do you need to do? First, we go to Hayes. I buried him a ways from our encampment. I need to pay my respects. I'll show you where he rests. He had a medallion in his effects. That's what I'll bring home to bury. After that? Then we find my two lost trackers and bring them home. A long time ago, we built an encampment in one of Monarch's cave systems. Trouble is, a mana queen showed up and kicked us all out. If we can find Rebecca and Anders, they'll know how to lure her out. Then we kill the bitch and bury everyone's medallions together. Sounds like a good way to add to the medallions. Sounds fun, let's go. We're going to have to kill a Manti Queen. Oh yes. I can't wait. <clears throat> Don't you think it's weird that you used to have... Uh, well, used to be in a group of six friends. And now uh, most of them are dead. That's not normal thing, I woke up. Okay. Uh, that's kind of far away. Search the house, yeah. That seems to be the closest one. Like those old Sundays when we'd unload salt. Right. Here's the road. Follow it south. Eyes up. Four, Cap. And that's how it's done, Captain. What? Are you bragging about it? I was the one who sniped them. Grip. I should probably. No, we're not taking that. I should probably buy some more mods. Uh, this is a good way to get some health boost, but it's also super heavy. So we're not doing that. I'm not sure why I'm dealing 1, 000, some 255 damage. I really shouldn't. I think. The stealth bonus is pretty uh, significant. I suspect. Am I in some kind of church? There's no local map here. We are very much just winging it. Yeah, sure. Oh, we're picking that. Nice hats. <laughs> I guess I'm picking up some booze. Yeah, 
It has the same design as the one in Edgewater. Can I do much here? So this is the temple, and these houses are evicted. Strike! Wow. Uh, just pick up the hide. Feels like the old bits outside of Edgewater. Used us, unneeded, left to settle into ruin. I need to reload my sniper. Doors. If anyone's inside, they're liable to respond with gunfire. Screw that. Mm, just regular water. It must be fine. I just see such a waste. All these houses. No one's living in them. So many resources wasted. What? I got a loading screen to go into the, the house? I didn't expect that. How big is this house? A visitor? What an unexpected surprise! Please, come in. Come in. I'm getting real bad fight or flight right now. Watch your step. People ain't this friendly outside city walls. Mm-hmm. The Edgewater deserters were perfectly nice, and they lived outside the city walls. Well, maybe not Adelaide, but everyone else. That's the spirit. Now come in. Make yourselves comfortable. Are you cooking, people? Thanks. Don't mind if I do. Excellent. You've arrived at just the right time. My wife is putting the finishing touches on dinner. Please, RV dinner. make yourself at home until it's ready. Something ain't right about this. Are you cooking people? Levy mother? So dinner is nothing? What a pleasant surprise. And just when I was beginning to fear we'd seen the last of good company for a spell. Yet the Eternal provides, does it not? If you're so eager for company, why live all the way out here? The Eternal does not desire that we huddle and hide, crowded in by walls. We all share the spark of the Divine, and we were made to spread it across the stars. Out here, we are free, and even apart from society. The universe provides for us, as your being here proves. Uh, things have a way of working out, I suppose. That they do. Though it's up to us to make the most of those opportunities, wouldn't you say? Look at me, prattling on as if this gravy is going to cook itself. Why don't you run along until we are ready for dinner? I guess I'm just gonna check around. You trying to get us all in trouble? What do you think you're doing? Wait, what? I was just leaving. 
Carry on. Does it get busted? Hey, what are you doing in my room? I was looking for you. Liar! You're trying to steal the last of my rocket candies, aren't you? Your rocket candies? The ones that come in a bottle with a rocket ship on it. Like the other man used to bring. The other man? I'm not telling you. I'm going now. Got busted. Let's talk. Spacers, choice pills, they cure all your ills. You guys are stay out. Moving. Yeah, I'm not gonna read poetry. I can sleep in their bed. Maybe not. What the hell is this shit? On my way. All right, so we can get outside. How tall is this house? Taller than expected. But I, I don't see anything suspicious yet. But it does seem to be... I, I don't know, maybe the cannibalism thing is just the red herring and they are into something else. Nope. Oh no. They into that. No, 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 no. They sulfur sodden assholes. Ain't enough that the raps eat everyone, now people are doing it too? Ooh, Braxton. You lost your head. If lost, please return to Ballard, Velma, at the current supervisor of MSI Fishery Operations in Stella Bay. Pick up soap at time. Wow. This boy, guys. I know about everything. Who wants to explain what's going on upstairs? Do I need to apologize again for stealing? Seems like they are gathered together now. But what's this? You're tracking blood into the kitchen. Oh dear. You've been nosy, haven't you? Direct, this doesn't have to end badly. The murdering cannibal accuses me of being nosy. Quickly, my dear. She's getting agitated. We can't let the meat spoil. Don't worry. We'll make this quick. Oh, Why am I stuck? No! What the fuck? Oh my god, game. Ah, okay. I could have saved some other dumb way. I could have left the house over here and came back. That would have been a safe too. Super proving my point that this whole save limitation is just dumb. And uh, quick save is just cool. Uh, don't worry. Incoming why am I stuck? That was, don't do that. Oh, yeah, let's kill him. Oh, look at the bright side. At least you're not gonna eat you. Dark matter bar? Oh. Ain't deserved to die so clean. Running something. Uh, hopefully that's not human. That's something. Level head. I'm super careful about what I pick up from these guys. So they decided to eat us. Very questionable decision. 
If three soldier types stopped into my house and started uh, snooping around, and I was a cannibal, and that was that, that was uh, those are some big, big, big ifs. But I was not a crazy person, and I know how would they react. I would just fucking leave and maybe come back later, if whatever, if that's my only shelter. But the point is. Or at least, at least I wouldn't allow them to just snoop around my house. And if they are snooping around, I would just fucking leave because I know how it would go. I guess they were just super confident. Speak with Velma at the fishery. Yeah, yeah. Family matter. Amber Heights. We have to go there. Far away. Meet with Katarine. And she is super far away as well. What about this place? Because nothing really points this way. Colossus. The raptor don't spin, we need to reload. Down they go. You guys just stay back. Don't try to kill all the raptor dons. Actually, can check their armor in slow mode. Fuck. Maybe I should use slow mode more. Just to get to know these enemies. here so yeah we can take their hide that's worth a little bit not a lot arms building key uh, garbage armor wait is the arms facility over here it is okay then there is a reason for staying here. Not like we couldn't do this uh, later, but why not? Why not right now? Can poison its prey with rapid claw attack. Resist domestication. High health. 10 armor. Done. Oh shit. Okay. Yeah, we don't really want their meat. Also, I shouldn't use the sniper rifle for every scenario. That's not what it's for. Here we go. Yo, kill the gecko. Over the slam. I have to run away and now it's kind of becoming tricky Sorry. to kill people. 
But I guess I'm just the captain here. And I'm not really killing anybody. I just I just run away and everybody dies by my companions. Uh works for me. Actually Parvati has a has a weaker weapon than she should. Let's fix that. <laughs> they have thousand DPS weapons. And I'm using a 200 DPS weapon. Let's reload. Guys, don't run in front of me. Everyone all right? Yep, they're all dead. Why do I have a feeling that this game uses different sensitivities for different weapons? I think it's true. just feels weird. Like, it definitely the uh, sensitivity is, is different when you zoom in. I mean, I know that. But it just sometimes feels weird. Oh, well. Careful. Only things you'll find in the Look out! Kill it. To shreds, you You got it, Captain. Hammer slam! Wow. We should get paid for this. Killing so many rap raptors. Okay, we need to zoom in. And there's really not much that we can do in this place. Everything is locked. And apparently, we can score a weapon. We might be able to climb up there. But it's unclear from there. Oh. Ladder. What? Fun times barrel. Oh, fuck. Alright. Can I go in there? It's sealed. So, whatever factory is here, we can't go in. Uh, but is there like a secret entrance over here? I really hope that they are just not aiming for like one. Maybe above average gun. I mean, that's not gonna do a damn thing. They need like a, an army of robots. They need to, first of all, deal with the uh, wildlife. And they also need enough protection against the, the board. Sanya has a good, a bad habit of padding his reports with numbers and statistics. Not very good with slogans, jingles, and or taglines. Uh, presentations tend to be dry and lacking in emotional appeal and funny references. Sanjar also displays a noted tendency to complete work rather than delegating it. A trend unbecoming in upper management. All in all, Sanjar's work uh, habits suggest a preoccupation with details and a startling lack of vision. We cannot recommend him for further advancement. Needs improvement in the following areas. Interpersonal communication, bruity, delegation, ID generation. I don't know. Persuasion helmet, anti-riot gear. 
Persuasion only helmet is kind of dumb because I got a better helmet. Necklace. What are you guys doing? Crap pistol. Elite troop armor. It's decent. Not amazing. It's worse than the best armor we got. Even the base value of it. Huh? Hello? Hello? I hear boots out there. Wait, can I ask for boots? It's not like a rupted on. <laughs> I'm just messing with you. Who's in there? Oh, thank the Eternal. I'm Huxley. Ah, uh, Hux, if you're lazy. I'm stuck. I, I, My I, friends and I were scavenging here, and a Mad Queen showed up. Then Rathodon, who's a void blast of mess. I ran in here, and um, now the door's locked. Little help? Well, I need to get in that room. Phew. Thanks, lady. My buddy had a key, but I ain't heard him in a while. He locked me in here and took off. Probably got munched. Yep. So look for a dead guy, I guess. Or a rat. Maybe it's in a rat belly. Gross. Ugh. Bet I could get through this lock. No oh, fucking 100! Uh I think I find it. Oh, much obliged. I think we have it. Ah, phew. Thank you so much. It was getting all stuffy in there, and I was getting a mite lightheaded, and I think maybe I was gonna die. Now I'm out here, and I'm headed back to Amber Heights. Still landing yourself in trouble, eh, Hux? Oh, hi, Mioka. Um, you mind giving me an escort back home? I'm... Oh, you're traveling with someone. Never mind. Hey, Huxley, if you want to replace Mioka, I think that's just fine. I Also, I couldn't decide through the intercom whether you were uh, a young boy or a woman. <laughs> Maybe that sounds mean, but I'm not. I don't mean anything dumb. I am mean way. Then I was super convinced that you were a young boy. And now you turned out to be a young woman. I mean, a uh, young, younger boy than, uh, <clears throat> than like, not you, woman in 20s. Uh, you sure you're okay to travel? With the trouble you caused me, you're dying here? What trouble? Wow, that's just crazy. And I suspect if I acted that way, I would soon have less and less companions. Like, for, exa for example, Parvati would... Uh, if I well, if I was Perbetti and the leader did something like that, I would probably, at very least, stop opening up, and uh, if I can, just leave right away, May, or maybe leave at the next chance I got. Like for example, if if I, I chose to leave uh, a monarch, I, that might be too crazy, you know. As a as a selfish way, I, I might just like you know I'm just gonna go to ground. Uh, to just gonna wait until I, I get to a better place, you know, just a planet I can settle on. Uh, normally, when you help someone, they give you something for the trouble. What, what would she give me? You sure you're okay to travel? Oh, sure, I'm a runner. I'm used to getting all dizzy and... Hey, who's your identical, slightly blurry friend? What? <laughs> And normally when you s help someone, they give you something for their trouble. Good luck. Do I want something? No, not really. Good luck. Thanks a lot, lady. Heavy machine gun, but it's trash. Flamethrower, but that's trash too, right? Come on. Maybe we'll pick it up.
Not that I'm getting richer. This is something that just happens to me in games. The more I have, the the gooder, the the kinder heart the person I become. And I don't think this is super unjustified. If it's a game with like nobody has anything, like fuck yeah, kill over like half slice of bread. But, you know, if, if I'm just doing well, like, yeah, I don't need rewards. You're just, I'm just happy to help, okay? Not that I just go out murdering. Oh, yeah, you're just trying to leave very slowly. Ah, fresh sulfur. Good to be outside. Okay, I might just, uh, wipe the terminal. Delete all. Okay, I'm like, there was nothing really crazy in there. That would suggest that Sanja is is just not suited as a leader. Suited to be a leader. If anything, it just seems like he is uh, uh, he's a doer and people didn't like that. You can't have somebody management who actually does shit. They'll never... Oh, here we go. That's smart. And that's how it's done, Captain. Yeah, you guys really showed me. So let's drink a glass of water. Maybe. Ah, uh, that's not it. Yeah, one apple. Why not? Let's see, maybe two apples. That's it. Yeah, we're not taking the the meat. Stellar Bay. It's over here. Like a mini ship. Okay. I guess we can go back. Tell them what's up. Good old Stellar Bay. Only place on the planet that don't stink of sulfur. On account of it stinking like fish instead. You reckon the smell ever goes away? <laughs> Okay, so we have two quests to return, which is kind of nice. And the Cleo's skin cream. And where are we in town? Uh, I guess we're gonna go to the cannery first. Also, I would like to hear about uh, the date between the the. <laughs> Well, the date that I've set up earlier. I'd give you a friendlier welcome, but I'm up to my elbows and salt tuna guts. I think it's Celia, and I'm not sure about the name of the guy. The monster part seller. I've got some bad news about Braxton. That he's got his load on and I'm stuck covering his shift? No. Give up Braxton an idea. He was killed by cannibals out in the ruins. He was having a bad time. That's... Wow. I sure feel like an ass now. Cheer up. Maybe now you can hire someone better. Ugh. Oh, that doesn't feel the best. I'm not gonna judge you. Like, it, the guy didn't show up. So I'm like... It's a bad way to go. He was having a bad day, okay? Yeah. I wouldn't wish that on Catherine herself. Still... It's good to know what happened to him. And that I ought to start looking for a replacement. Something else on your mind? Ah, oh, that's it. Lively up! What am I supposed to put points into? I might just start not spending my points. Do I spend my perk? I don't know what to spend a perk on. Harvester is kind of pointless. I 
I don't know. I can up my base armor rating, but actually I'm putting in so little effort in in keeping my armor awfully decent, then what's the point? This is what I should have picked up earlier. It would have been maybe nice. I have no idea. TTD per kill. Nothing really screams here like, oh my god, pick me. Resilient seems like something that would be useful once I actually start taking Garmin seriously. So if we get to a tough situation, I think that could be decent. And I suppose I should just pick it. Because then I can equip armor and have a bonus too, so maybe do that. And we'll get access to tier 3. And uh, here we actually have a few interesting options. Not not crazy amount, but... We'll see. Next attack after killing an enemy is a guaranteed critical hit. But basically all my attacks are guaranteed critical hits anyway. Uh, the armor master is very interesting. We can have armor rating bonus. So that armor, like I, for example, wear an armor that has 60. So 10% 10, 10 of that is plus 6. And also the skill bonus. So we have like a determination on it, then then double of that. I think that's gonna be something we pick up. So I think we're just gonna commit to armor here. Not like this is a prerequisite to the armor master, I believe. But uh, still, it's it's a little bit of advantage. And honestly, I'm just being an idiot for using a crap armor. But mostly, I kind of got away with it right now because I'm fighting melee and they just don't hit me. If it becomes hard, I guess I'll start using proper armor. And it's also level 18 now. Rizzo's gear is usually top tier. 46. 40... yeah, 46 helmets. Elite troop armor gold. And now, let's check it out. Nioka Parvati. So, Nioka is using one, Parvati is using one. Nioka actually has a better armor. Taste of freedom. More like crappy gear. Look at this shit. What is this? It's garbage. Rizos! This is what we like! Uh. Elite troop armor gives me dodge. I don't know. We want to buy the advanced defensive uh, helmet gold. That's for sure. And I don't know about the elite troop armor gold, but it seems decent. So if I need armor, this is it. And I might need to consider putting in a skill skill kit. Let's, let's do that. So, for example, I, I have, have an armor now that gives me advantage into long guns. Which is... Eh, I mean, it helps. But not as much as not dying. And I guess I can sell. So, we can look into the armors and we're gonna have three uh, Rizzo armors. I can tinker it, make it a little better. It doesn't need to be super good. It's already pretty pretty decent. But I don't want to bust. Uh, I mean, just let go broke here, lose all the money. Uh, not like we're in any danger of that. So we can modify the armor, the one I got recently, to 
you have skill kit of silver tongue. What? This drops my armor defense rating or what? Oh, factory factory stock armor plating. Oh, so I shouldn't change that. Skill kit. No matter what I do, we have less armor. It just seems weird. Is it is that really correct? Let's try it. Okay, we can we have the advantage of quick saving now, so uh, we don't have to do something super dumb. I just see. So I put this in. Factory stock armor plating. No, we don't lose armor. We just gain uh, the other bonuses. This is lock picking. I guess I can use that. Uh, armor is more important. This is what get what gets hit. Nioka can use this helmet, and Parvati is already using a pretty good combo here. I can look at the inventory, and I can just keep carrying the stuff I got. Long guns. Yeah. Wait, I kind of eliminated the penalty for this armor. Did I do that? Oh yeah, I did. I did. Wow, no, I didn't. Skill bonus plus dodge, but style skills minus 5. Oh, fair enough. So, we're still gonna need something to switch into. Leadership skills 5, but persuasion plus 7. That's actually just worse than Reed's hat. Uh, I should just sell things to whoever is willing to buy. Actually, it can be the, the vending machine. Uh, I don't really have any advantage. When it comes to selling uh, related to people, we can sell that, we can sell the hat, we can sell this crap, uh, sell, maybe keep stout skills. We only need one, but I'm kind of keeping two, and let's just go. Uh, this is fine. Flamethrower is crap, and this is most likely what I will not use. So may as well sell it. Let's go! And we have to talk to Sanja, who's somewhere behind me. I hear you workers were on the clock every available Sanjar! moment. You should know you're getting excellent reviews from across the company. I what am? can I do for you? Aren't you the only one who's doing the reviews? I found your review on the terminal in the arms building. You weren't supposed to look. I asked you to delete it. Sorry, it was already open. Oh, yes. No doubt someone else was <laughs> having a laugh at my expense before you. <laughs> This has been my albatross, the great shame of my career. I give MSI everything. My work, my youth, my left kidney, and for years, I was a joke to them. Your left kidney? What's up with that? Uh, one of the executives required a transplant. I thought volunteering to donate might improve my prospects. Did it? Apparently not. <laughs> Who cares what they think? You're in charge now. Yeah, in charge of a scrap heap of a city. Abandoned by the board and surviving only through the hypocrisy of our trading partners. Mm. You made it work. That's more than anyone can say for those execs. I hadn't thought of it that way. But perhaps there's something to that. Thank you for that. Or was there something else? I do... Uh, question his motives a little bit. He seems a little eager to prove himself, but also he seemed to genuinely care about people and not just in it for himself, else he would have 
uh, ran away. Ultimately, I think he's a decent leader, despite his uh, desire to lead. Uh, which usually just uh, disqualifies anyone <laughs> from leading. <laughs> oh, man. Give him the bolt uh, 52. I found the cartridge and deleted the data for you. Oh, yes. I'm going to be up all night with this. Uh, all those blanks waiting to be filled, boxes waiting to be ticked. Try to control yourself, sir. Have you any idea how powerful this is? Corporations have been toppled with less. Okay, how exactly is a data cartridge going to help? You you made it sound like you were sending me after a weapon. But that's exactly what this is. The world isn't changed with guns and speeches, much as Graham and his followers would like to think, but rather with meticulous documentation. Okay. And the bill of liquidation slash transfer form 52 is one of the most formidable pieces of data entry in all of Halcyon. One false stroke can invalidate the entire document. It's true. One of the old execs gave herself a stroke trying to fill out the exemption section. What? What does a Bolt 52 do exactly? For our part, a bill of liquidation slash transfer form 52 will protect our holdings on Monarch by temporarily assigning them to a pass-through entity once we drop our bomb on the board. Um, bomb on the board? Like... Okay, spare me the details and just tell me what comes next. No, no, I want to know. Yes, finally the board will get their comeuppance. I, I just want more information. Sort of. Really, we're just going to blackmail them into offering us a seat at the table. But really, whatever gets you excited about the idea. <laughs> it's definitely a firm middle finger. I can get behind that. That's what I like to hear. <laughs> I have reason to believe that one of the other corporations is operating on Monarch. Illegally and in secret. Those bastards. Leave us to our perils, then come back just to reap what they can. If we can find proof, I can use that as leverage to... encourage certain powers that be to accept our Bolt 52 and reinstate us on the board. Hmm, Sanja, you sly dog. I like you. I, I really like people in power, but I like you. You really think so? I admit I've been hatching this scheme for quite some time. I just needed someone capable to help me carry it out. If someone is operating here, then Catherine's almost certainly supplying them out of Fallbrook. Perhaps she could be convinced to tell you where they are. Hmm... I know how to make people talk. Oh, I imagine <laughs> you do. But as much as I love your can-do attitude and dangerous gravitas, Catherine handles all of our shipments. Damn. So it would be best if you could leave her in one piece. Is that how you people put it? Come on, I'm not a tug. What do you people? No, no, no. I, I'm, I'm cool with that. <laughs> Close enough. Once you, uh, subtly work out where this corporate facility might be, bring back proof of its operation. Maybe some nice letterhead. Or someone working there. That would do it. Infiltrate a secret corporate base and kidnap the staff. Sure, easy. I'm on it. I'm just on it. <laughs> I knew you were the right person for the job. I suppose I'll leave you to it. Okay. Celia Robbins, uh, would you like to tell me about your dates? Hmm? No! Please! I need to know! It's important. Follow up with Catherine Mallon. Meet Catherine. Look for Tucker Needham in Amber Heights. And speak with the information broker in Devil's Peak. Who is... Over there. Two marks. We have Family Matter. So we should go and and stay on the road, and we also just gonna meet up with Catherine, who is much farther away. So yeah, I guess that's the plan. But why is Riso stuff so good? Everything else is garbage. Riso is selling the best stuff. 
We gotta find the proper Rizzo merchant. What do you think of the unreliable Parvati? There's always something to fix, and it's neat working in the Aether. I always took Atmo for granted. Now, if I drill through the hull, we all suffocate. Exciting, you know? I, I'm not sure I wanted to know that. Being in space sets me on edge enough. <clears throat> you know about stellar emissions? Actually, I probably should. Actually, this is a... Uh, wow. Actually, uh, wait, I have some skill to points to, to spend, but I'm not sure on what. Wait. Right. Okay. I can't open up we my skill thingy. Drinking this conversation right out of my recollection. Why not? I couldn't open it up. Oh, it works. I have no idea why it didn't work. But never mind that. Uh, persuasion. I don't know. I don't know what to go with. I can just go up to 60 hacking, 60 persuasion. But I might not need that. Ordnance, control, helmet, gold. Oh yeah, that's boosting my persuasion as well, but actually this is a better way. Uh, I, I got some MSI Elite Helmet. This is total trash! Like, this is what I'm talking about. You're just giving me complete garbage. Ah. Yeah, whatever. Anyway, uh, thanks for watching, guys. We'll be heading out next time.